And one of our initial goals was to get the storage shed empty. So this is uh, the day it looks like it is going to happen. Uh, All done. Okay, so having emptied our container of quite a lot of the boxes, well, this is my paperwork. <laughs> uh, there's a combination of, there's hardly any bellies in there, it's nearly all mine, but that bag there is just full of shredding. And I tend to, I don't have to do it, but I tend to, I tend to shred anything that's um, got financial information in it or our, our name but don't know why maybe I'm a bit over the top a bit obsessive about that but yeah I look at that and I kind of get a little bit down thinking I've got to get rid of all that but two years on that all went into storage two years ago and I had my reasons for keeping it but two years on I'm pretty sure all of that is going I just need to sift through it, sort of folder by folder. I, I guess the question I ask when I pull all this stuff off the shelf is, and I look at each of it, I say to myself, will this piece of paper or this folder, will it add to my life? And uh, if it doesn't, and I don't need to keep it legally, then I am bending it. We'll keep things like photos, photo albums, stuff like that. But other than that, it is history. A bit of a tedious process to go through to, to slowly but surely do it. Um, but some of you might be a bit more ruthless than me and just ditch it. So anyway, one step at a time, steady as she goes. Yeah. Sorted? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> what do we do now? I need to put it in the tray. Yeah, in the wear. Excellent. Do you think we can get any more in that box? A little bit. A little bit, eh? Hey? Let's shuffle it all down. <gasps> Got a lot of shredding today. It's just Okay, it will still go down. We can get more in there. Hold the bag open for yep. me. So this is a significant portion of our 
what was in the storage shed. And this is uh, quite a bit of progress. Well, this is all pretty much, um, well, everything on this side here is, is, is either for sale or is just being given away. It's got some storage boxes there that are now empty and some friends coming to collect them. And those are the blue boxes that had all the paperwork and filing in. So those are just empty folders now and they'll just be handed out. And the rest are sort of a lot of loose ends. So if you're wondering what's in the um, odd boxes, it, it's pretty much just odds and ends, you know, things you accumulate over the years that are in drawers that never get touched. Uh, you think you're going to find a use for them one day, but you invariably never do. So that's 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 pretty much all mentally. There's a uh, there's some ski stuff there we've decided to get rid of, and a printer and an office chair. We're going to keep the buggy here. And we just found out um, someone might want that. And over on this side is some things we're still keeping. The middle row of boxes are being taken away by other people. And we're keeping pretty much just what's down there. And maybe these two boxes here. And there are some more. Uh, I'm thinking our progress is that we're we're going to go down from a container load to a pallet load but that remains to be confirmed but we will definitely be getting rid of that container and we think um, uh, a family member's offered us some warehouse space uh, if we can get it all on a pallet so that's the goal. Perk, can you write two or one above the word perk? So we're just getting prepared for the car boot sale. Item is one thing. Further commitment to our minimising and downsizing. Uh, it looks messier than it is. It's just the boxes have all been pulled apart. I'm going through them now with the final tooth comb. Do we really want to keep this? Do we really want to gather dust? We no longer have a storage container but do we still even want to keep it around with friends and family so. down my nana's antique tea collection that i thought i gave away but i think i might keep that so yeah we will keep some stuff we just so we do have a we've been offered about a pallet load of space and we're gonna take well, yeah we'll, we'll keep a few things but we're trying to really just fine tooth comb if we don't need it and someone else can make use of it, who knows when we're going to be back. We're still a month or two away from leaving, but um, we don't have anywhere permanent. So, yes, yeah, it's, it's more just the exercise of just letting go in your head and the rest is just Sorry, I did that, but I put getting rid of it. Some cake over there. Sure. Okay, so I've done the heavy lifting and now the girls are doing the, the sorting through the bits and pieces. And even Romy's in on the act, just huddled in there with Mummy. Volunteer, so probably knew how to. Nearly there. One more fold. Yeah. We've got a single bottle. Yes, you can. And the priest might even go in there. Let's just try one more fold. With my fold. I'll just. Just fix it. That's about. Today we're at Ellie's mum's, uh, it's the middle of, well it's nearly the end of February, we've got Romy's passport 
we're planning on heading away in a month. We haven't booked it. Um, so we've come back to Ellie's mum to go through the rest of the stuff and try and get it down less and less and less. So uh, behind me, we have got our friend's car and it's full up with my clothes and things we've been trying to sell but haven't been able to sell. Um, stuff like that maybe costs, probably runs into thousands of dollars in clothes when it was bought new. I just don't want it. It's not serving any purpose and if we can't sell it or it's time to give it away to a happy home. So Ellie is going to go down to Habitat for Humanity. Uh, it's a Saturday morning. Apparently they're open. And she's going to take Ayla and I'm going to hang out with Romy in the wrap and do a bit more tidying up in the garage. That box is mainly my old clothes that I used to wear for work and oh, so those are all my old clothes. Um, work shirt and a formal work shirts. There's a suit carrier that yeah used a few times but no one seems interested in. Inside that bag is cushions. Decided we're not gonna have them. Underneath there there's some belts and tires. Not gonna be wearing them. There's some shoes that have been sold on Trade Me and here's a bunch of things that we think are worth something that we're not gonna put out on second hand Sunday so so yeah, we've, got, we've only got one more second hand Sunday before we leave. So this is why we're going to the charity shops to see what they will take. And if they don't take it, then we'll give it away. Because we hope the charity shops can sell it. <gasps> okay, I'm with Ayla right now. Little miss, what, uh, what's going on here? Can you, can you tell everyone what's going on? And when you say store, what do you mean? Like, me keeping the storage and keep at Nanny's. Oh, okay, so you're going to have a few toys to come back to Nanny's, is that right? A few toys at Nanny's, and, and a few things in the storage. Oh, okay, we're just... Maybe, well, maybe in the storage. Okay, and a few toys for... Taking. Taking with you. Oh, okay. That's very nice of you. I might give away. Now, what, can you tell me the ones that you're going to take away? What have you got to fit them into? This and well, only kind. Well, yeah, this. Would you consider putting the umbrella down just for a minute while you talk to me? Thank you. Just be careful with that. May I hold it for you? Oh, just. Just while I talk to you. Oh, that's good. You can put it up in a minute. So tell me, you're, the ones you're going to take are going to go in... So this is for your trip. Where Where are you going? Vietnam. Is that what you said? Yeah. Just show me what you're taking. You, that looks like a... <laughs> that's just an iPad bag, isn't it? But you, would you, And you put your tiny toys in there. You call them tiny toys, don't you? Well, but I'm not going to put a tiny toy in there now. I'm like putting this in. Right. And, and I'm going to take my other blue toy toys. Tiny toys are just little ones that go in the bag. Yeah. There's a lot of stuff here. It's a big decision to decide what's going and what's staying. Eh? What are they? Are they fairy cards? Fairy or fairy card. snap? And is this playing cards? Um, All right. I'll go fish cards. Cool. Ben, you gave me them. All right. Wow, can I do anything to help you? Yeah, sure. What can I do to help? Um, put some things in the bag. Um, I, I, but I'll tell you what to put in, okay? All right. I think, yes. me, I think I want to say, do you think I can take this? I think Ayla and I got our work cut out here, so time to help out. What do you think? What do you think? I think it's up to you to decide. I think maybe not. Those are things you can get like kind of all around the world. Yeah. And they'll be here still. Yeah. They'll still be here. So maybe that can help us decide what we keep. I'm bringing this because, well, I'm actually not bringing it, but I'm bringing this. 
this to brand toast because it's got a lot in it now. Well, not because it's got a lot in it, but it's got a lot in it now. Because then we can put a new string on it. Because we need new string. Um, this is the new string. It was from the little shaker. Where we got honey bunny from. Um, with the little shaker. Um, we got it. The, that was it. Um, that's the string that is here. Get it. Is this part of choosing what you're keeping and what you're not keeping or? No. Okay. Should we get on with that job? Okay. It is the Saturday before the final uh, second hand Sunday and we have been moving all the stuff out of Nanny Annie's into the storage shed. It's been a pretty productive day. Uh, these drawers are actually empty and we just can't decide whether I'm going to keep them or not. There's a snowboard up there that we haven't been able to sell, so Ellie's going to have one last effort to see if she can get rid of it on Trade Me. We've got about 10 days before we fly out. We haven't booked our flight, but uh, that's the plan. Um, those are snowball boots, and underneath are our bindings. We're just trying to get rid of them. This is a box of e-waste. And then from here onwards, this is all second hand Sunday, and very... And Nanny Annie is going to uh, put it out tomorrow. So just a few things that we've just gone, yep, don't need them and haven't been able to get rid of before up until now. So yeah, that's it. That's it. After several months, we're down to that. And looking like the end is in sight. Yeehaw! Bring on the final second hand Sunday and Nanny will be clear of all our stuff.